Okay, this is on the Isvelson job, 53889, install on 1116 by Aaron. So, it's going to be a fun one. Prepare yourself in all the good ways. We are switching out this furnace with the, uh, everything's bigger, so bigger furnace, 410 AC and all that. Um, but to make all this work, we're gonna have to turn the furnace this way. So I wrote on the ground, the furnace will sit right here, looking at the front of it. <coughs> okay. Um, then we'll have a a duct here and a double tall filter box with one door, two 16 by 25s. Piece of duct, the canvas, and then a transition. So if you look inside the return air, you can see that all this return air is just sucked up through the back of this here. Um, so I'm not sure how much of this starting collar you can get to the back, but just make it as big as you can. Cause I can't tell what they've done, you know, back there. But yeah, make it as big as you can. Otherwise just attach it to the sheetrock. And um, we'll go there. They do have this um, nine inch return air here. So when you get everything out, you'll have to tap this back in wherever possible. You have to tap it back into the top of this or something and whenever you can do there. Okay, your supply. So all this return airdrop comes out. Um, but that's all they have, it's just an end cap right here. Whatever return they have, it just ends right here. So, um, supply, I'll give you a cut line right there. And, um, so you're gonna add this piece, this canvas starting collar. Dog to sit on a base. Furnace will sit on the base, coil, and that. So this will go down half an inch. Um, and then this is, I'll set up three inches. So just put it where needed, but came down half an inch. Um, Cause we have the sheetrock, half inch sheetrock. Gosh, feels like thicker than a sheet rock. I might have to come down one inch. I think there are two pieces of sheet rock together. It is, it's two pieces together. Um, um anyway, so, this flue here, you're just gonna cut and abandon. Um, this water line, you could push up um, and strap it up as needed. Yeah, I'll change that to one inch. There's definitely two pieces of sheet rock. Anywho, um, okay. So that's it on the duct. And by the way, the hours may not reflect accurately on this. Um, this is a lot of added stuff to this job. So combustion air, not applicable. The vent. So you're gonna have to run Two new three-inch PVCs out. 
and I'll explain to you. So this two inch, originally they went up, over, and then up and out, and under a deck. Well, that won't even work for us. Um, and this is what I think. When you get out the duck ripped out, you might see something better. But they have this header here. They've got a joist behind it, which they've already cut out um, for the line set. But then the joist switch directions. So I gave you a six by 20 slip slip end cap. And you're just gonna have to modify this on the job. Um, but I figure cut the corner off this angle and use that end cap to modify a cap for that corner. Um, because that is return air. Um, and I'm not quite sure what it does back there. So hopefully this will work. <laughs> um, and then you can get your three inch pipes under, under the beam and then hop up and out. So over here, I'll kind of show you what they did, just in case something over here doesn't work. There's other options. <laughs> so in the bathroom, I believe this is what they did, this little angle here. I believe that they came over with a two inch and then came up and over. But actually, I don't think we want to do that. Unless we just had to come up over a little bit. And I'll show you why. <laughs> I'll show you why in a minute. Let me go over the other stuff first. Um, so, they have three air conditioners. I'll go over that in a minute too. The drain will just go to the floor, standard order. Um, thermostat, you're going to put on a Honeywell two stage stat. There is only four wires existing right now. Um, so, if you can, pull a new wire. The thermostat is way over there on the top floor, so I'm guessing you probably won't be able to. You might have to put the dip switch timer on. I'm not sure yet. Um, okay, power, we use switch and box and cover. Um, so we tap in this nine inch return air, wherever is the best and must out of the way. Okay, so let's go out. So they have three air conditioners. So this panel here is for the old part of the house. So our panel that we're dealing with is over here in the addition area, right here. And um, our existing 40 amp breaker is okay. So, let's see if we can get out this door. Yes. Okay, so verify this. I was told this is our AC here, the one on the far left. Um, our new one will not fit here. Um, I talked with Jason and the homeowner, and we decided to put it over here, the new one over here. So you have all the line sets that go back here. So you're just going to have to run the line set. You know, make sure you have enough um, to come over and put the AC right here. The disconnect, we're going to have an electrician move it. They will use this disconnect as a junction 
I can probably even just take the whip and pull it over and just add a new disconnect um, over there. Okay, so our flues, right now, this is that two inch flue. We just came out under the deck and 90'd it down. Um, we need to get two three inch flues out and um, in the future, the homeowner is going to, he's going to build a metal deck with uh, the decking going the opposite way. So we can tap off on, tap onto our flues in the future and bring them all the way out the deck. But for right now, um, keep in mind there's this vent here and I don't know exactly where we're coming out, but um, I'm guessing it's right here somewhere. But we're going to come out and our vents are going to 90 up. The supply or the um, intake, you can even just leave down probably if you wanted. But our, in, our exhaust will have to 90 up and go through the deck. And then 90 out with a stinger on it. And it kind of looks like there's a flue right there. Right above that flue is that this door. So we need to be over here so we can 90 up. He said this barbecue is going to go away. So it's not going to look the prettiest right now, but they are going to redo this deck and so fix it better later. Okay. Um, let me just show you the thermostat real quick. Because they do have lots of thermostats. <coughs> FYI, you do have a furnace room here. Um, I don't think there's anything you can really do from here. But just know you do. Let's see. I'm gonna start. So the stat's gonna be over on the far south. Um, this is all the new addition. is right there yep. for this one so if you can pull a new wire great if not put it on the staging and that's it